Her new album is her fourth studio recording, and we're so lucky she's been able to share some of her indie folk gems from Secrets with you tonight. Please welcome South Australia's own Laura Hill. Good evening, everyone. How are you? You look lovely. Look at you. Uh, here's a song. Um, I don't have a set list. I kind of go with the flow a little bit. Um, but I wanted to play this little song called Dreamer. Um, it's on my CD, Secrets. And I think it's important to have dreams. Would you agree? Doesn't matter how big or how small they may be. Something to look forward to is really important. I've had a really tough year last year, so um, more important now for me than they ever have been, especially when you, ooh, especially when you see people, you know, go through things and gives them something to look forward to. So I achieved one of my dreams. I poached an egg. Well done. Pat on the back. <laughs> a round, solid egg. We shall chat. It's none of this whirlpool. It's not vinegar. It's salt. It's just 18 eggs and you get it. Well done. <laughs> Thinking about how I could fly like the wind Thinking about how I could break these chains I know that I'm a dreamer Well, I know I let you down If only you could feel it You might believe that without a doubt before now it is all I can think about I think about how I could fly like a bird Thinking about how I could find the world I know that I'm a dreamer Well, I know I let you down Why, if only you could have feel this You might believe that without a doubt But for now it is all I can think about Think about how I might change the world Think I would like to be your girl And I know that I'm a dreamer Well, I know I let you down 
Why, if only you could feel it, you might believe that without a doubt. So will next week, tomorrow, today, right now. Oh, 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 oh. oh. friends. Thank you. Um, I'm going to play a bit of a new song. It's only a couple of weeks old. Um, I don't really have a name for it yet. Maybe you could help me name it. I'll probably make it up, but you won't know. Tonight, 
Thank you, thank you. And this is Hold Me Tonight. I kind of thought, that's a good, I kind of got the uh, chuffed. Oh, right. Oh, okay. We will take bids later, lovely. Yep. This is a song about socks. And, uh, I thought I would play this because I forgot my socks. And uh, I don't know if you saw, but um, there was a thing on, um, on the media about a pho photograph of a black hole. Did anyone see this? Yeah? My socks are in there, yeah. <laughs> I thought that's where they go. And uh, that's the first thing I thought of. And then like the next day, you know how you get all the mims and that's like, that come out? There was one with guitar picks in the middle of the hole. I thought that was good too. So. I don't know where they go. This is a song called Odd Socks and um, I wasn't going to play it but I'm in the mood. And uh, I do have a CD down the back, one that's called Powdered Sunshine and it's a little solo EP that I made a couple of years ago actually. And I found, because I've been camping, I found some in the caravan and I didn't know I had any left. So, limited edition down the back there. <laughs> so get your socks on. And, and if anyone has Odd Socks on, and you show me, or you come down the front, put your foot up here, I'll give you a copy, of, I'll give you a free CD. There's always one person. And kids don't count, because they have old socks. I'm not one for expensive things Gucci high and buys all that of bling What I'm feeling You cannot buy I bottle this I'd like to see you try Why all oh, we could go anywhere Why we could go anywhere Any socks givers they think? It's the way you move, where you smile gets up, you go over. I could not find. I am beside myself when you are gone. I even love those all songs you've got all of them. Well, you walk past like sweet summer rain The pure smell of you that drives me insane 
Love everything from your head to your nose, your eyes, your lips, arms that are no goals. Why oh, we could go anywhere? Why we could go anywhere? It's the way you move, way you smile. Guitar, pick a word I could not find. I am beside myself when you were gone. Even like those are songs, take the long way home. Take the long way. Take the long way home. We could all take the long way. So I had the best cake I've ever had today in Borough. Seriously, a rhubarb and cinnamon cake. It was so good. I got the lady to ask me a recipe, but she was a bit sus on me because she thought I thought maybe she was, I was going to start a cake shop up next door. But we took the long way home that that day, and it was the best decision ever because there's good cake in Borough. We should take the long way. Taking the long way. Taking the long way. Take the long way home. We should all take in the long way. Take the long way home. Why you gotta take the long way? Ooh, hey, taking the long way home. We should all take it the long way. It's the way. It's that rhubarb cake <laughs> Put on a smiling face Oh, oh, oh. take the long way home Taking the long way Taking the long way home We should all take in the long way It's the way you move is the way that you smile Gets up, pick a well I could not find I am beside myself when you are gone I even like those odd songs Well, I even like those odd songs Look at those odd songs You've got on You've got all, all. You've got all, all. Baby, you've got all. Thank you. Yes, question time. Yes, yes. <laughs> you got socks? Go on, come on. Come on up. Yeah, do they smell all right? <laughs> oh, we have a black. Yep, wait for it. Hey! <laughs> we'll grab a CD. Go for it. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. Well done. So, what was your name, Sock Boy? Sorry? Sock Boy. Ashley? Anthony. Anthony. All right. Make sure you get your, your free CD. Well done, too. A lot of people, like, there's always one person that's in, like, oh, I've, I've got odd socks on. 
but I'm not going to do anything about it. I'm just going to sit here and not get a CD. But well done. So respect. Respect. I'm going to play a little song um, that my, my dad used to sing to me when I was a little girl. Um, and he can't be here tonight. My parents have been pretty sick, folks, and I'm not saying that out of, you know, to feel sorry for me. But what I am saying it in, in the fact that life's pretty quick, hey? And things happen at the last minute you don't expect, so it's really important that you, you follow those dreams. So if you've got an egg to poach, I've got some eggs for you, okay? So get out there. And do what you need to do. But I'm going to play this song for my dad. And uh, has anyone here been to Tasmania? You. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I love Tasmania. I go there every year. I think I've been there like 14 times. To the point where I should probably look at some real estate maybe. Because it would be a hell of a lot cheaper. And um, my, my husband, his name's Darren. He's in the, we've got a caravan at the back. And I have a three-year-old. Um, that's all I have to say, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, um, he's, bless his cotton socks, he's out there with her, putting her to sleep. We have had the best time on the Air Peninsula and she is exhausted. Like, we have been salmon fishing, we have just really pushed her to the limits to the point where we looked at each other and went, we're really bad parents. Like, we need to just, she's only three, like, you know, and she's jumping off cliffs and it was full on, so she's getting some sleep. But um, I lost my train of thought. Oh, yeah, talking about Tasmania. He's a photographer and... Um, we kind of have a secret life where sometimes we go play music and then um, we go out into the bush. Um, he shoots medium format, which is film. Um, you would know that, yeah? Yeah. You're, you're intelligent people. Yep. And um, he also does underwater um, surfing shots and, and things like that. But this one time we went out a place called the Tarkine. Does anyone know where that is? So we're out there and I thought, thought to myself, you go take your photos I'm going to find a Tasmanian tiger. Because, you know, you, they're extinct, but you're always that person that's like, I'm going to find it. Anyway, we were out there and uh, he was taking photos and I got pretty lost. And realistically, I was probably only like where the exit is there. But is anyone one of those people that when you go shopping, you like park your car? Yeah, I'm in the front of Coles, second door, awesome. You come back out. My car's stolen, but really you parked in bras of things and you, you're like 2Ks that way. I'm that person. But I thought, since you're all here and you're warmed up, were you all happy? Yeah. 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 All right, let's do some shoulder rolls. Some jaw exercises. So what we're going to do is, uh, you, you might know this song. It's a bit of a cover song. It's my spin on it. Um, it's called Little Red Riding Hood. So you are my wolf pack. Together we are going to sing the little words, Little Red Riding Hood. You reckon you could do that? Because I'm all alone up here. I'm quite small. Oh. All right. And, uh, John, if you've got some, like, spooky, you know, you've lost in the woods kind of effects, you just go for it, buddy. What full lips you have 
Have you ever seen or something by you Before you get to grandma's place Walk with me and you will be safe Are you ready, Wolfpack? Okay. <laughs> We've got an eager wolf. So the words Little Red Riding Hood, are you ready? A one, two, three. Oh, little red riding hood. Oh, Wolfpack, we are so going on tour, we're going to eat so much cake, we're big convoy, big caravan convoy. Um, what am I going to play? Can you tell me my set list, John? I can't remember any. I'll just make it up, that's alright. Ashley, oh yeah, that's a good one, yep, I'll play that at the end, okay, no surprises, but I thought I'd play this song because I haven't played it for ages, and um... There was a time where I, um, you get to support um, some amazing, amazing musicians like Daniel. We were in the house before and I was like having my own private show. I was in a rocking chair and he was just serenading me on the guitar and it was so beautiful. 
But sometimes you, as a support artist, you get to su support some real rock stars and some real egos. And uh, this is my experience. I'm not going to say who it was, but it's a well-known Australian rock person. And, um, oh, nah. <laughs> nah. And um, I was asked to support him, and it was just such an odd experience. And because you know, you come in, you're like this young singer, so I'm rather hi, you know, you're really excited, hi. And um, the first thing I was told was um, I had to take my, my, this is really strange, I had to take my heels off. Is that weird? Yeah, that's weird, isn't it? Maybe because he's short, there's a clue. <laughs> the next thing I was told was I wasn't allowed to play my electric guitar. I was like, okay. And you could tell his management were telling me all this and you could just see their face like, you know, deep down. They didn't want to have to say this. But And then I wasn't allowed to have my CDs anywhere near this person. I had to have them down the end. It was really strange. Anyway, I came home and I was just really flat and then I watched Game of Thrones. <clears throat> <laughs> and um, I started to think of, of, of fame and... You know, game. Is any game, any Game of Thrones fans out there? Oh, good. <laughs> oh, we'll talk about that later. But, but um, I started to think of, of of how life is just a game for some people, and how this guy was almost similar to Game of Thrones, where they it's just a game. And this is a song called "The Game of Fame," and um, we'll chat later about Game of Thrones, though, because it's pretty good. Someone's like, yelp. Who's that? Yelp. <laughs> it was kind of like half Jon Snow, half this other guy. But... <laughs> Well, the road was thick and muddy and easterly blue. There's a light well it lingered from the plains. A fox in the head of light passes through. His motives are lost by the rain. I never met anyone like you Oh, I never felt that way before Cause no one here looks familiar The game of fame You can polish your medallions deep inside the grave And how far will you go to kiss that light of day Your pockets are all empty playing
the game of fame. Pockets are all empty, playing the game of fame. How long do you intend to live your life that way? You can polish your medallions deep inside the grave, and how far will you go to kiss that light? Your pockets are all empty. Your pockets are all empty. You know they are all empty. Your pockets are all empty. Thank you. Thanks, guys. So, um, speaking of Game of Thrones, back to the person that's saying, wow, where are you? I'm having a Game of Thrones night at my house. Kid you not. We're all dressing up. There's going to be big goblets. We're going medieval. And there's also going to be a bit of a Game of Thrones like somewhere down south. So, anyone's interested, come and see me after the show and uh, we'll chat. This is a song called Blue Eyes and again, I haven't played these songs for ages. It's a pleasure to be here. I'm sorry I couldn't be here in December, but I'm here now. And what a venue, hey? This is great. I feel like I'm in a family room. We're all just related. Uncle Bob, anywhere? No. (laughs) Anyway, this is a song um, I travel in Australia a fair bit and I was going over to the Great Asian Road to play at the Mornington actually and um, I got a, a CD stuck in the car for the whole trip and it was Otis Redding. Does anyone like Otis Redding? Oh, isn't he amazing? Anyway, it got to the point where he was, you know, it's a long drive and you're by yourself to the point where he was almost sitting next to me and I got a bit delirious and I started like talking to him. It's like, Otis, like... What's it all about, you know? What's life all about? He didn't say much, he just whistled, but... (laughs) I thought to myself, I just want to write a song like you. I want to write a song like you. And uh, I pulled over, and this is what came out. So here's a song called Blue Eyes. And could I trouble someone for some more water? A cup of sugar? Well, it can be over. Well, it can be true. Well, I wrote you a letter. It didn't get through. Thank you. <laughs> That's service. So I lay away And I'm trying to breathe Did you love me? Oh, maybe the thought of me So, so What you all wanted to say And ooh What you need me to do Oh, I use tears While filling up my blood 
blue eyes There was loneliness And love in you And I keep walking From door to door I'm hoping I'll find Oh, what I'm looking for But I have surrendered But I've got no relief Oh, only loneliness Oh, to come for me So you need me to do oh I use tears while they're filling up my blue eyes there was loneliness in loving you oh the loneliness in loving you Thank you. Um, I've got one more song to go. I'm just going to swap over to my acoustic. Just give us two secs. So thank you so much, guys, um, for having me. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much.
Oh, thanks. Oh, lovely. Um, thank you to um, John down the back. Sounds great up here. And Di. Um, and Dan for, for letting me su support you and for like serenading me in the couch back there. That was lovely. I had my own concert, my own private concert. Anyway, I'm going to play a new song. I don't normally do this, but I thought life's about taking risks. Would you agree? Yeah, why not? So this is a couple of weeks old and um, it's a brand new song. I've got a new guitar. You like it? Um, I haven't played it much. Um, it's made of blackwood, but um, the guys at Cole Clark, um, and Dan will show you how they really sound. Um, he, he sent me this and it was funny. I got an email from him yesterday just, and I said, thank you for you know, sending me the guitar. And this is called A Little Lady. And I do a lot of busking and a lot of travelling. Sorry, I talk a lot. I know if I've got one song, I'll be really quick. And, um, and he, he sent me this. And at the end of the day, at the end of the email, I said, oh, what made you pick? Like, so you, you just pick a guitar that you think would suit me. And then he goes, okay. And then at the end of the email, he said, I'll oh, just pick this because it looked good with your hair. <laughs> and I thought that was cool. He's like one of the best guitar, you know, manufacturers. Yeah, you just have this, it looks good with your hair. I thought that was really funny. Anyway, here's a song called Happier Now and um, this is a brand new -y. Thanks again for having me. You guys take care of yourselves. Thank you. And I do have some CDs too down the back, so if you like what you hear, you want to take me home. In fact, you should buy a dance too. Buy five of his. Get him around the country a bit more.
Thank you and good night. Cheers.